Hello, hello. Hello, Luis. Can you hear me, Luis? Hello, teacher. Hello. Yes. How are you today? I'm fine, teacher. And you? I'm fine. Just kind of hot in here. <laughs> okay. Very good. <laughs> uh, what about over there? What about over there? Can you hear me well? ¿Se escucha bien o se escucha cortado? I can hear you very well. Okay. Mm -hmm. So what about over there? It's hot or it's rainy or it's windy? Um, it's a windy day, windy night. Oh, okay. So are you from, yes. where are you from? I am from Santa Ana. Santa Ana. Well, Santa Ana, it's a very cool place not cold but kind of cool right yes it's um a weird uh, wait, winter uh, it's so so kind of mm -hmm. yes so so okay all right not yeah yeah so, uh, uh, i've been to santa ana i guess like two times i think like two times i've been to santa ana around two times Mm -hmm. it's a beautiful okay. place yeah In what place do you visit? well um i stay there because the next day i was going to ilamatepec uh, volcano i was going to the volcano so i stayed there mm -hmm. you climbed that yeah i climbed me yeah. and my friends uh we went in the morning we didn't go in the very early morning no 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 but it was in the morning, in the morning, yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Okay, welcome, welcome Osman, welcome Jacqueline, welcome Miriam, welcome Carlos, welcome Fatima, welcome Thanks, Christopher. Teacher. So how are you all today? How are you? My day was normal, mm, very busy all day. Okay, busy? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Busy. Day. But oh. uh, it was a good day for me. A good day? Mm. Nice. Yes, a good day. Okay. Mm, how about you, Miriam? How was your day? Good evening, teacher. Good, good evening, evening, everybody. Uh, my day was hard because I I went to look for a job. Looking oh. for a job. Oh, you went to where? Where do you go? Uh, different places. Oh, okay. Uh, for example, to, uh, yeah. To look for a specific, for jobs. uh huh, uh huh, a specific oh, okay. call center. Oh, okay, okay. In Spanish, in Spanish. Oh, okay. No, no, that's fine. Yeah. That's that's fine. Hopefully, uh, they can hire you. Mm -hmm. Hopefully. <laughs> yes. Okay. So, welcome, Fatima. Yeah. How are you today, Fatima? My my day was tired because oh. I have to do all my ordinary activities, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and I just come in this moment. Uh, uh, only I I was running. Oh okay, okay. I guess I feel I feel I feel what you're saying. Yesterday that happened to me. I came home like like around 7 7 30 from my other job and i was like oh my gosh i had to i had to take dinner and then i had to kind of relax a little bit just to start the class i was kind of it was kind of tiring yesterday it was a tiring day mm -hmm. yeah all right so hello jancy how are you jancy 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 hello Hello, Gen Z. Hello, Gen Z. No, well, probably she's having some problems with the with the headphones, I guess. Mm -hmm. Okay, Carlos, how are you today, Carlos? Hello, good evening. I'm, I'm my day is really tired. I was a day very busy. 
and I have a lot of work today. Oh, okay, good, good. I mean, the good thing after that, the good thing is that we have a job, right? Mm -hmm. My day was yeah. tiring. My day was tiring. Remember? I was tired. I was tired. My day was tiring. Okay? Todo lo que sea no relacionado okay. a ustedes, so it's ing. Okay? For example, the movie is okay. exciting. I am excited. See? ¿Sí? Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, or for example, the noise is annoying. See? ¿Sí? ¿Saben qué es annoying? Annoying? Yes? Okay. Yes. I am an yes, I am annoyed. See? ¿Sí? See? ¿Sí? The noise is annoying. I am annoyed. See? ¿Sí? Okay, estoy molesto. La bulla es molesta. Mm -hmm. O es una molestia. Okay, just don't forget that, please. Okay, good. Uh, Jancy, how are you today, Jancy? Yes, I'm fine, mister. Good. Now I can hear you well. We can hear you very well. Yes, mm -hmm. yes. Ah, okay, good. Uh, Christopher, welcome. Or welcome, Miguel. How are you today, Miguel? Hi, teacher. Hello, Miguel. Yeah, nice. It's well. Hi. And you? Oh, how are you um, your day? Uh, it was very tiring. My day was very tiring, yeah. And I'm thinking that tomorrow I will need to get up very early, around three o'clock in the morning. So I'm just like, I'm thinking about it. So it's going to be a long day tomorrow. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Yeah. So I had to train some teachers. So I need to work on that. So I need to work in a workshop to teach how to teach English. Yeah. But yeah, that's, that's, that's part of my job. <laughs> okay. So welcome, everyone. Uh, it's very, very good to see you. You know, next week, next week, we're going to be finishing this course. I believe it's going to be next, what? Next Tuesday, I believe. It's Tuesday, I think. I'm not sure it's Tuesday. Okay, so unfortunately, that day, I'm not going to be teaching the 27th, that day. Somebody else is going to be covering me, okay? So, but I'm going to tell you more about that on Monday, next Monday. I'm going to give you more information about that. Okay, so um, let me look for uh, the material that I'm going to be, that we're going to be look, we're going to be working on today. And today we will work on, yes, I'm going to share with you in this moment. All right. Um, okay, good. So we're going to be talking about today about time contrast, all right? So basically what we're going to be doing is we are going to be looking at uh, the simple past, the simple present, and the future. All right. If I give you a verb, let me see any verb. Uh, who can give me a verb? Can anyone give me a verb? A verb? Un verbo? It. It. Okay, good. It. it. Okay, good. It. Okay. Uh, who can tell me a sentence in simple past with the verb it? Simple past. I was it some pupusas. Okay. I ate some pupusas. Mm -hmm. I ate I some pupusas. Oh, I yeah, but this. yeah, yeah. Usually, the, listen. Yeah, you can say estaba comiendo. Yo estaba comiendo unas pupusas, pero qué pasó, verdad? Qué pasó? I can say that. You can say that. I was eating some pupusas, pero qué pasó? Oh, cuando? Oh, you know, yo estaba comiendo unas pupusas cuando me asaltaron, for example. Sí. Pero si fuera solamente pasado simple, <laughs> pasado simple sería. Uh, yo comí pupusas, ¿sí? I ate pupusas this morning. Okay, how about present? If you use uh, was, I have a question, sorry. Mm -hmm. uh, when you use was, you need to uh, put a complement. Okay. Well, that's... most of the time, because usualmente, even in Spanish, we don't say, for example, I was cooking. Okay, unless somebody asks you, hey, 
What were you doing when I call you? Oh, I was cooking. See, I was cooking. I was taking a shower. I was watching a television show or I was doing something. See, in that case, yes. But okay. the sentence by itself, like, hey, I was cooking. No tiene mucho sentido, al menos que alguien le haya preguntado. Yeah. Or you are explaining that something else happened when an activity was in progress in the simple past. For example, I was taking a shower when you called me. See, I was watching mm -hmm. TV when you were knocking the door. Ting, 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 ting. See, I was working when you came home. See. So in that case, yes, uh, I can say that there are two actions. One that it was in progress when something else happened. ¿Sí? Mm -hmm. no. okay. okay, good. Uh, vamos a ver, in simple present, what about in simple present with the verb uh, eat, to eat? A sentence with the present? Mm -hmm. I eat hamburger today. Okay. Oh, I eat hamburger today or I eat hamburger every day. Mm -hmm. Every day. Yeah. Okay, good. Okay. How about in the future? What about in the future? The same verb. Yes? I will I will I will eat pupusas on on Saturday. Ah, oh, okay. I will eat pupusas on Saturday. Okay. The reasons why the topic is uh, the name is time contrast is because we're going to be using the three tenses. Simple past, simple present, and simple future. And just give me a second so that you know how you're going to use it. All right? Okay. What is the main objective for this class? At the end of this class, you will be able to describe events using time contrast between the past the present and the future, all right? For example, uh, for example, if we're talking about cell phones, you are going to be able to describe how cell phones were like 20 years ago, how cell phones are right now, and how cell phones are going to be in the future, see? So basically you are describing and explaining something in the past, in the present and in the future. For example, the computer. <laughs> Remember like a long time ago, computers, they were super huge. Now they are kind of small. In the future, who knows? They could be like mini computers. Okay, mini computers. All right, so that's what we're gonna be doing today. Okay, so please uh, get a piece of paper. We're going to do this activity right now. Okay, in a piece of paper, uh, we are going to work on vocabulary. Vocabulary. All right, instructions. Write three words in each category. Okay, for example, we have uh, times of transportation, words that finish with letter S, countries that begin with letter P, words that begin with t things in the water it could be under the water or on the water all right in the water okay en este caso sería en el agua no sobre el agua in the water and then famous people and then family members okay vamos everyone quiero que escriban en a piece of paper i want you to write each of the different category three Three times of transportation. Um, uh, three words that finish with letter S. Three countries. Three words that begin with letter T. Three things in the water. And three famous people and family members. Okay, vamos, everyone. And let me know when you finish.
Ok, ¿por qué número van ya? Four, five, six o seven. Teacher. <ríe> no me digan que todavía están en la uno. No, no, no. I don't believe you. Uh -huh. Teacher. Ajá. Uh, teacher, we have a, 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 a one sentence. No, only uh, words. Palabras. Miren lo que dice acá. Dice, I... escribe tres palabras en cada categoría. Palabras, ¿ok? ¿Ok? Ajá. I, I, I was Writing. Writing. Ajá. Three sentences, one no. sentence. Simple uh... words, simple words, ¿ok? Tres I'm palabras sorry. dice ahí. ¿Ok? Ok. Hurry up, everyone. Ojalá que no vaya a estar copiando, ¿verdad? Yo veo ahí algunos copiando. Cheating, jaja. Looking on internet, no. Do not look into internet. Ajá. Le dice Yancy, no me des copia. Ajá, me no, Yancy dice, don't give me copy. Ok, go, go, go. <ríe> ok. Le dice Yancy, no me des copia, por favor. Le dice. Ajá. Ajá. No, I'm, I'm just kidding. Okay, uh, what number are you? Are, do you finish? Do you finish? No? What number? Four, five, six, or seven? Vamos a ver quién escribió en el chat. Oh, Christopher, do you finish? Christopher, do you finish? Yes, teacher. Okay, who else has finished? Thank you, Christopher. ¿Quién más ha terminado? Solo son tres palabras por cada categoría. Three words for each category. I finished it. Okay, good. Who else? ¿Quién más? ¿Quién más? Okay. 20 segundos más, and then uh, we are going to stop the activity. 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 3, 2, 1. Time's up. Time's up. Okay. Time's up. Time's up. El tiempo ha terminado. Time is over. Okay. So what we're going to do right now is I would like you to share your sentences in small groups. All right. Para hacerlo más rápido, I'm going to have only pairs, parejas. Solo parejas. Okay. No, no, wait. Give me a second. Okay. Ahí está. Okay. So compare and, and provide your words with the participants. Okay? En parejas. Go. of transportation what words do you wrote teacher in my oh. in my case uh -huh. i i wore uh -huh. i wrote oh sorry no 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 es que oh. eh, quería ver si la la no sé si la imagen la puede compartir porque yo acababa de entrar mm -hmm. uh, vino tarde entonces va uh -huh. Sí, pero, pero sí. Estaba Vaya. comiendo. No coma. Vaya. Sí, yo sé. Pero he esperado. <ríe> no, no. That's, uh, no. Eating is more important. Rapidito, solo lo va a tomar. Ok.
Pudo? Could you do it? Okay, thank you. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> In my case, mm -hmm. in the first types of transportation of Peru, Polonia, and Panama, okay. and what what do you countries you put? What countries you put there? The the only, <clears throat> only Polynesia and Polonia. Polynesian Polonia. Mm -hmm. Nice. Okay. Uh, how do you say? Four? Okay. How do you say Polonia in English? Because uh, supposedly you needed to write in English, not in Spanish. Aunque comienza con letra P, verdad? Con letra P. Pero en inglés. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. No en español. Not is the same. In uh -uh. uh -uh. Peru, Peru oh, en inglés, okay. teacher. Yeah, Panama and Peru, uh, they are the same. Pero Polonia, the same. no. The same. Polonia the same. is different. Polonia is different. Uh-huh. That is oh, Poland. 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 Uh, yes, Poland. Poland. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Uh -huh. I'll let you work. Continue to uh, continue working and sharing your, your answers. Okay. So, yeah. We finished, but um for the transportation bike, bus, boat. What about you, Osman? Transportation, car, boat. Um, car. Car. Okay. But uh, N and S. Pops. Less. Looks. Kiss. Miss. Buses. Okay, okay, okay. Um, um, I don't know if I gave you enough time. Probably I didn't give you enough time, right? Do you share your sentence? I mean, your words. Compartieron sus uh, sus uh, sus palabras. Yes. Not all teacher. All of them? Yes. Not all of them. No. Teacher. Wait, yes. I have a question. Yes, yes. Tell me. Tell me, Miriam. Okay. Uh, words. Uh, words that finish with s, in plural or singular. Ah, it's a trick. Teacher. Okay, What's that trick? one. That was What's easy. A trick? <laughs> that could be any word. Cualquier palabra. Ending oh, with okay, S anywhere. Okay. It could be like uh, <laughs> computers, books, uh, houses, any word. Okay. Uh -huh. Yeah. Plural okay, or everyone. Okay. Ayúdenme, ayúdenme, por favor. Times of transportation. Help me, help me, please. Everyone. Taxi. Motorcycle. Motorcycle. Taxi. Bike. 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 Car. Car. Bus. Bus. Airplane, airplane, bus, bike, buses, bike, helicopter, helicopter, subway, mm -hmm. train, train. Good. What about words? Words that finish with letter S. Shoes, shoes, shoes. sports, sports, sandals, sandals, keys, keys, keys. bus, uncountables, <laughs> buses, buses, wishes, wishes. Delicious. Okay, good. I guess that one was the <laughs> easiest. Ese fue el más fácil. Okay, what about number three? Countries that begins with P. Countries Peru. that with P. Peru. Huh? Peru. Uh, Peru. Uh, Puerto Rico. Panama. Puerto Rico. Panama. Philippines. Paraguay. Paraguay. Peru. Portugal. 
Mm -hmm. Peru. Peru. What? Peru. Polonies. 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 Poland. 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 Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Pakistan teacher. Uh, oh, Pakistan. Yes, Pakistan. Good. Mm -hmm. Pakistan. Pakistan. Another one. No, right? Puerto Rico. Puerto Rico, yeah. Palestine. Oh, Palestine, yeah, Palestine. I mean, Palestine. Palestine. Mm -hmm. Palestine. Okay, uh, what about number four? Words that begin with, um, with T. T. Um, tomato. 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 Take. Take. Tomahawk. Power. Thomas. Pa uh, yes. Tomahawk. Oh. Tomahawk. Thunder. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Thunder. Tasty. Tasty. Uh -huh. Try. Okay. Good, good. Uh -huh. Hello. Teacher. Teacher. Uh -huh. Try. Exit. Okay. Try. Etc. Right. Things in the water. In, in the water. Fish. A fish. Uh, dolphin. Frogs. Dolphin. Frogs. 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 Uh -huh. Good, good. Uh -huh. Dolphin. Dolphins, dolphins, dolphin, dolphin. Uh -huh. dolphin. Uh -huh. Starfish. Uh, Starfish. Starfish. Tiburón. Oh, Tiburón. Shark. 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 Baby shark. Shark. Do, 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 do. shark. Baby shark. Uh -huh. Do you remember that? Uh, teacher, yeah. what yes. is the correct form of, say, crab, cangrejo? Oh, crab, 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 crab. crab. Mm -hmm. Be careful, okay? Pro, uh, pronuncia uh -huh. muy bien Cocotrán. esa palabra, porque si no, lo, si no pronuncian crab, pueden pronunciar otra cosa, okay? Crab. Yeah, <laughs> yeah okay. okay? Be careful with that. Okay. Mm -hmm. Crab. La otra puede ser otro sonido, ajá. Uh -huh. Crab. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, cocodrilo. How do you say cocodrilo in English? Does Cocodrile. anybody know? Cocodrile. 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 Crocodile. Yeah. Crocodile. Okay, good. Okay, nice. Rhinoceros. What? How do you say caiman? Caiman? Rhinoceros, teacher. What? The, ca the ca Let me caiman? Caiman, the... teacher. Oh, caiman. How do you say caiman in English? It's, that's not the, the, the same. La palabra es bien olvidada. That one? I don't know that one. Let me see. Caiman. It's not the same crocodile. Hey, it's no? a different. It's different. It's different. Alligator. Alligator. Oh, alligator. alligator. Yes. 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 Alligator. Uh -huh. Alligator. Yes. Alligator. Okay. Suena como alagarto. People say alagarto, right? Es un nuevo vocabulario para el teacher ahora. Yes. Alligator. <laughs> alligator. Yes. <laughs> I know that one, but uh, usually we say alagarto. We say alagarto. Most of the time we say alagarto. <laughs> Pero en realidad Alligator. se llama caimán. Alligator. 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 Yes. Okay, good. Vamos con famous people. Nelson Mandela. Adel. Nelson Mandela. Adele. Alanis Morissette. Putin. Uh -huh. Putin. Uh -huh. Barack Obama. Bill Clinton. Nayib Bukele. Nayib Bukele. Nayib Bukele. Okay. Uh -huh. Another He's one. Very famous. Uh -huh. it's around she... the world. Yes. Another one. Um, uh, uh, huh? Michael Jackson. Michael, Michael Jackson. Jackson. Okay. Uh -huh. Madonna. Cocolito. Madonna. Ay, Chocolito. Uh -huh. Yes. Okay, and, and thank you. <laughs> okay, thank you. You are the best student that I have. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> Número siete, number seven. Family members. Granddaughter. Uh -huh. Oh, granddaughter. Spouse. Dad. Cousin. Cousin. Niece. Uncle. Niece. Sister in law. Sister in law. Mm -hmm. Nephew. Okay, father, con esa palabra, uh, okay, maybe I'm going to stop a little bit in here. Be careful, be careful the way you say it, okay? Porque si no tienen cuidado, lo pueden decir así, ¿sí? Sister in love. In love. Uh -huh. in, in love. love. Puede in ser love. que su hermana in está love. enamorada. Be careful with that, uh, okay? Sister in love. Sister in law. 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 
Sí. Law. 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 Mother in law. Law. Uh -huh. law. For example, law. Uh, mother in law. Sí. In law. Sí. Okay. Father in law. In law. Father in law. Okay. Ajá. Mm. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, okay. What else? ¿Qué más? ¿Qué más? Stepsister. Okay. 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 Good. Thank you. All right. So thank you for participating and let's move on. Vamos a la siguiente. Okay. Do you remember that we were talking about what? We were talking... Um, we're talking about time contrast. Basically, that's what we're going to be doing today. We're going to be talking about time contrast. For example, look, the way people entertain in, okay, wait. The way people entertain in the past. Vamos a ver. ¿Cómo se wait, this computer is just playing with me. Mm -hmm. See, entertainment. What about in the past? What about in the radio past? Radio and movie. Radio. Yeah, radio and movies. And movies. And movies. What about now? Mm -hmm. Computers, Computers games, games. High, high definition, definition TV, TV, smart TV, movies, and three D movies, right? Okay. What about so, in, in the future? They'll control it. Okay, they'll control, control video, video control games, control video. And, and VR, and virtual reality, virtual reality movies. Yes. Movies. Si ustedes, por Hologram. ejemplo, Hologram. yes. Okay, usually, uh, yes, uh -huh. good, good, good. VR means virtual reality. ¿Han visto ustedes alguna vez, por ejemplo, VR, VR, que dice VR? VR means virtual reality. Okay, virtual reality. Okay, so that was the way people entertain in the past. How about, how about transportation? Mm -hmm. Transportation in the past? How do people move train. from one place to another? Train. Uh -huh. Train. Trains. Mm -hmm. Train. Or how do you say carreta? Oh, uh, that is... Um, uh, does anybody know how to say that? Mm -hmm. Tumbril. What? Tumbril, algo así. Oh, no. Tumbril. That one, it's... um. Let me see. I'm going to type it here. It's carts. Mm -hmm. Carretas. Usually a cart, cart. A cart, it's like it has a, a horse With or it has a horse ox. Or... Uh -huh. ox. Ox, yes. Yes, ox. Okay, so ox. Donkey? Where's an ox? Okay. Uh, donkey? No, no, no. <laughs> donkey is different. Do donkey is burro. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Donkey. Mm -hmm. Way. And ox. Way. Way. Ox is way. 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 Mm -hmm. way. Ox. Okay. Cart. So in the past, people moved through railroads and ocean liners. Okay. Or carts or bicycle what about now in the present what about now in the present car motorcycle motorcycles uh-huh uh-huh what else jet jet mm -hmm. jet mm -hmm. away mm -hmm. okay how about in the future what about in the future Teletransportation. Oh, yes. Or self-driven cars. For example, Tesla. You know Tesla? The Tesla cars? Yeah. Yes. They self. Uh, they are self-driven uh, cars. Son carros que se manejan solos. ¿Sabían eso, verdad? Yes? Okay, good. What about communication? Y eso quiero que ustedes me participen. What about in the past? ¿Se acuerdan en el pasado? Do you remember in the past? I, uh -huh. Telegram. 
telegram. Cartas, teacher. Cartas. Uh -huh. How do you say cartas in uh -huh. English? Por una palomita, teacher. Letters. Letters. Uh -huh. Letters. 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 Do you remember? No sé si acuerdan. Uh, messenger. Well, yes, messenger. Yes. Messenger. Mm, not really before. Oh, well, maybe, yes, in the past. MCA. Do you remember when you used to go to Publitel? Publitel? I guess that was the name Publitel or Publicel. Publitel. The yellow, the yellow boots, telephone boots. Yes, a box. Yes. Ajá. Uh -huh. yeah. ¿Se acuerdan Publitel? Compraban las tarjetas de tres dólares. Do you remember that? Ah, uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I remember. I remember. And Or on do you Saturday. Until. Until. Ajá. Uh -huh. Until. Until. Mm -hmm. Until. <laughs> so, si querían llamarle a alguien. So, le llamaban una hora, una hora con anticipación y luego tenían que ir a hablarle a esa persona para que viniera que tenía una llamada. <risa> <risa> Los jóvenes no entienden Beeper. eso. Yes. By Beeper. Beeper. Oh, Beeper. Oh, Beeper. Yes. Yes. Uh -huh. Beeper. Uh -huh. Facts. 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 <risa> yes. Okay. How about now? What about now? Ah. What's up? Cell phone. Cell phone. Video. WhatsApp. Video. Video conference. Call. Emails, video, video chats. I had chats. Mm -hmm. What else? Social networking. Mm -hmm. Right? Yeah. What about, how about in the future? What do you think about in the future? Those are some <sighs> ideas. Mm -hmm. In the future? Probably for by holograms, holograms. 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 Yeah. <laughs> yeah 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 why not mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. what else que mas que mas como será la comunicación in the future telepathy maybe <laughs> well, maybe <laughs> ojalá uh, well ojalá uh -huh. well I don't know but it could be mm -hmm. yeah do you remember like who would have thought who would have who would have thought that three years ago we would think that we would be studying and learning English through a computer, like virtual classes. ¿Quién pensaría eso? Nobody, right? Nobody, to be honest. Right? Okay. All right, so let's go to the next page. Okay, those are some ideas. We are contrasting what? The present, the past, and the future. Okay, let me clear all this thing. Okay, let's go. Okay, I have a conversation right here. And if you are very curious, if you are curious, you will see that I have highlighted some words. And those words, what kind of category words are they? What kind of words? Okay, for example, this neighborhood sure has changed. I know a few years ago, not many people live here, but the population is growing so fast these days. In past, they huh? talk about past. Uh -huh. They talk about past. What? They talk about past. Ah. A few years ago. Yes, a few years ago. Mm -hmm. Now, many people live here, but the population is growing so fast these days. So, what is a few years ago? ¿Qué es eso? Mm -hmm. It's something about the past. It's a time expression about the past. Yes, time expression. But, but Hace not... Pocos años. Uh-huh. Not, not specifically... Uh, Uh, a specific time. Uh -huh. time. Uh -huh. Yeah. Yeah. A few years ago. Hace unos años. Hace unos años. Okay. All right. The next. Vamos a ver. Remember how we used to rent videotapes at that little video store? Yeah. Now it's a multiple cinema. And I hear they are tearing down our high school. They are going to build a shopping mall soon. There will be just malls and parking lots. That's because everyone has a car. 50 years ago, 
People walked everywhere. Nowadays, they drive. That's progress. Okay. Can you tell me which time expressions are referring to simple past, simple present, and future? Mm -hmm. A few years ago, 50 mm -hmm. years ago. A few years ago, simple past. past. Simple past. past. Present, Good. Now, now, present. And now present. Simple now present. In the okay. future. future. In the future. Some. Good. Some. Soon. Five years Soon. Ago, the past. Soon. 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 Okay. Soon. Soon. Mm -hmm. Okay. Nowadays. Nowadays. What's the mean? Okay. Present. What is nowadays? Mm -hmm. En estos días. Present. Uh -huh. Ahora en día. Ahora, Ahora en día, día o en estos días. Okay. I have a question for you. How do you say actualmente in English? Actualmente. Actually. Actually, actually, actually no es actualmente. Huh? No. Currently. Aha, Currently. good. Actually is realmente. Actually means en realidad. Or realmente, actually. Yeah. <laughs> okay. At the and, moment, teacher? At the moment? Uh, no, actually. Actually. Ese es en la actualidad. Actually, can... actually it's en it's... realidad. En realidad, actually. Uh, we can use to say de hecho. De hecho, in fact. In fact. De hecho, in fact. Ok. Be careful with this one, porque en español hay algo que... Es, I mean, in English, there is something that we call for friends. En inglés. For friends. Ok. Jacqueline, what are four friends, Jacqueline? All friends, what is the meaning? Ajá, vamos a ver, Jacqueline. Four Jacqueline. friends. Ajá. <laughs> Yo repitiendo estaba dicho. What is I'm four friends? Teacher. Ah, okay. Amigos falsos. <laughs> <laughs> no. Yes, four iba friends. a decir eso, pero Ajá, pensé friends. que era una trampa. Como palabras um, falsas o palabras tramposas, algo así, no sé. Adelante. Yes, well, the thing is, we have a, por ejemplo, when we are learning English, we might think that we heard pregnant. What is pregnant in Spanish? When you have a baby. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Correct. Yeah. Correctly. So what about this one? Eso es como a ver, Gonzalo, a ver, uh -huh. Those are for friends. Porque nosotros vemos, por ejemplo, oh, embarrassed. We think in Spanish and we say, embarazada, oh, yes. embarrassed, embarazada. Ah, teacher. No. Like no. a cima with this and cima with exactly. different men. Mm -hmm. Porque, ah. uh, for example, uh, si vemos esta palabra section, oh, ustedes saben directamente, ustedes van a decir, ah, sección. ¿Verdad? En sección. español. Pero si vemos la palabra, por ejemplo, actually, Ah, o sea, ah, actually va a ser actualmente. No. Actualmente no Ajá, es. Exactly. Eso es no realmente. es. realmente. Por eso, este tipo de palabras como embarrassed, uh, actually, they are for friends. Okay, for friends, because they mislead you. They mislead you to a confusion. Okay, to a bad translation. Okay, so currently, currently es actualmente. Actually, es en realidad. Ok. Good. De hecho, teacher, cuando uno ve un programa en inglés, yo veo programas uh -huh. en inglés, uh -huh. y al principio, por eso supe yo que actually era realmente por el contexto de la conversación exactly. del personaje. Exactly. Uh -huh. Porque no era nada que ver. Y luego escuché currently y el contexto ya hablaba de eso. Pero ah. son palabras similares. Que uno visualmente cree que son similares. Pero exactly. Su significado es diferente. That's why, uh -huh, yes, that's why we call it what? For friends. For friends. Okay. Listen. Okay. Now that we. In know... Spanish, Mr. Yes. In Spanish, uh, the name is homonymous. Homonymous. Palabras homonymous. 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 Igual, pero significa well, okay. homonyms. Homonyms. You mean homonym. But homonyms. in English, it's different. Homonyms in English is, for example, this one. It's the same word with different meaning. For example, this one. Bat. Bat, like... Bat, uh, the, bat the, the animal. Bat the, bat the animal and bat the... The what? The iron to 
hit a ball. ¿Sí? Eso es homonyms. Homonym. Homonyms. Homonyms. Una palabra Present. que se escribe igual, pero con significado diferente. Uh -huh. Por ejemplo, yes. bat de ánimo, como murciélago, y bat como el bate. ¿Sí? Uh -huh. Ya, yeah, ya. Yeah. Ok. Ok, good. Depende del right. contexto, ¿verdad? Depending on the context, yes. Exactly. Por ejemplo, the next word, right. Como mi mano, right, derecha, y como directions. Go to the right. I mean, go over there. Mm -hmm. Of oh, correct. Of oh, correct. Mm -hmm. oh, yes, of course. exactly. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Okay, now that we know that we have time expressions to the past, time expressions referring to the present, and time expressions to refer to the future, I want you to pay attention to this one. Mire, ¿cómo está el verbo acá? Look. Past. Simple past. Simple past. Future. Future. Past. Simple past. Okay, good. Present. So, present. yes, every time we are using time expressions, we need to coordinate the time expressions with the verb. If I'm, if I'm using a simple past time expression, that means that the verb will be in simple past. Okay, look, if I'm using a time expression to refer to the present, that means that the future, I mean, that the, that the verb will be in simple present. And the same happened with the time expression for future. See, the verb will be in the future. All right? Okay. Okay, okay good. Now, uh, let's see uh, some exercises. Okay, those are some other examples. We have more examples to express, uh, to express time expressions. For example, of the past, yesterday, last week, last month, last year, a little while ago, an hour ago, this morning, in the past, a long time ago, the day before yesterday, recently, in 1989, when I was born, one week ago. Those are some examples, okay? Uh, what about the present? Uh, to refer to the present, we have today, this week, this month, this year, at the moment, now, at this time, nowadays, these days, right now, as we speak. Okay? As we speak. How, how about, about as, yes. we speak. as we speak? As we speak. As we speak. As we speak. As we speak. As we Como speak. nosotros hablamos. Yeah. Mientras hablamos. Como mientras nosotros estamos... hablamos. Okay. okay. Okay, the next one. What about for future? We have tomorrow, next week, next month, next year, in an hour, en una hora, in an hour. Puede ser in two hours, in three hours, soon, in the near future, later this evening. Si estuvieran en la mañana y dijeran ustedes later this evening. Mm -hmm. Pero ahorita no puedo decir later this evening because... Uh, ya pasó evening in the future wait off in the future wait off in the future what is wait off in the future what is wait off in the future mm -hmm. como algo la, algo largo en el futuro como falta mucho para el futuro wait off wait off in the future the day after tomorrow and eventually eventually okay look I have what this does it mean eventually? Eventualmente. Eventually. Eventually. Thank you. Okay, good. All I right. thought it was a false friend. Too. <laughs> In this case, no. Okay. Okay, look. En el pasado, look. Aquí está hablando de, de las personas. A few years ago, not many people live here. These days, the population is growing so fast. Soon, there will be apartment blocks everywhere. Okay. Vamos a, a hacer este ahorita todos juntos, okay? Vamos aquí. In the past, in the past about mm -hmm. computers. In the past, computers. ¿Qué, qué pasaba con las computadoras en el pasado? In the past, computers. Eran lentas, teacher. Ajá, uh -huh. how would you say that in English? Was slow. In English. Where? Ours was is, is slow. Uh, where? Because it says computers. 
were yes. slow. Now, uh -huh, now they are very fast. Okay. Uh, they are very fast. Good. Fast. Fast. In the future, uh -huh, in the future, they, they uh -huh. will. Okay. They will. Yes, yes. I'm looking. Okay. They will. They will what? In the future, they will. Um, automatic teacher. They will be automatic. Okay. <laughs> okay. No, es que sea real. Pues, no, but, but, but it might be. It might be. <laughs> who, who knows? Imagine. In the future. All right. Si ven, aquí podemos Solo expresar. Vamos a hablar, teacher. ¿Ah? Solo le vamos a hablar y ella hará todo. Yeah, uh, we will speak to the computer and the computer will do everything. Ok, si ven acá, por ejemplo, aquí estoy, ¿qué? Estoy uh, utilizando los tres tiempos, right? To express or to talk about one item, ¿sí? In the present, ¿sí? I mean, in the past, in the, past. In the present, and in the future, ¿sí? In the past, computers were slow. Now, they are very fast. In the future, well, what happened here? Okay. Okay, it's gone. Okay, we'll now, go wrong. <laughs> yeah, uh, anyway. Okay. So, let's practice right here, all together. Vamos a hacerlos todos juntos. Okay. Escojame un iron y vamos a trabajar todos juntos en escribir oraciones acerca de ese iron. Mm -hmm. What about uh, cameras? Car, car. Oh, cars? Okay. Vamos con carros, entonces, cars. Okay. Vamos. Um, vamos past. a ver. In the past, los carros. Cars. Car was bigger. Where? Okay. Cars where? were bigger. Big. Bigger. Big. Okay. Big, ok. Oh, Los carros big. eran grandes. Yeah. Ok. At this time. Uh -huh. They are. They are. Sophisticated. They are uh, fancy. Pongámosle fancy. Caros. Sophisticated. Comfortable. Oh, comfortable. comfortable. Ok. They are comfortable. 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 What about in the future? Mm -hmm. they, they, will, will, yeah. they will be electric. They will be electric. Or smart. Okay. Or they, they will be uh, electric cars. Okay. They mm -hmm. will be fly teacher. Oh, oh, that could be another one. Yes. That could be electric cars. That could be another, another one. They will, they will... Fly. Fly. Yeah. Fly. Uh -huh. Vamos. Ahora escojamos del teléfono. Vamos a ver del teléfono. Hagamos el del teléfono ahorita todos juntos. In the past. Telephones. The telephones have cables. Hmm. Don't have. Has cables. Don't have. They were... Don't don't. Recuerden. Yo les decía y les mencionaba, cuando estamos utilizando time expressions in the past, los verbos va a ir en qué va a ir? En pasado. Si estamos utilizando time expressions en el presente, el verbo va a ir en presente. Si estamos utilizando time expressions in the future, el verbo irá en futuro. En este caso, in the past, uh -huh. telephones, uh, where, 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 Weren't okay. Weren't in the Have past. Cables. Okay, pues, hay muchas opciones. Puede ser telephone. Didn't have camera. Didn't have cameras. O oh, puede okay. ser didn't have cable or had cables. Uh -huh. Pero me gusta este, el de la cámara. Vamos a ver. Me gusta este de la cámara. In the past. Telephones didn't have cameras. At this time, ahora, they have a 
Okay. They have, at this time, they have... Very good camera. Very good My camera. Cam camera. Microsoft. Ajá. Uh -huh. What about in the future? Vamos a ver en el futuro. ¿Qué cree que pasaría con la cámara? In the future. Huh? <laughs> the camera. We will use hologram. Uh, <laughs> I can see that all of you are, 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 are thinking about holograms. Mm -hmm. Do you think is that okay, is possible? Yeah. Do, no. do you think that is possible? Oh, really? Sensor. They have sensors. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. The cameras will have... Uh, um, will have sensors okay oh it could be there could be um okay. so you exist yeah yeah because you just do this for example for example a camera you just do this and then uh, the sensor um identifies you and they can take a can um they can take a what a uh, a picture mm -hmm. a picture all right okay they will have high technology Higher technology, higher tech. See, higher tech. Okay, vamos a ver. Next one. Okay, vamos. Yeah, this is the last activity that we're gonna do today. Okay, everyone, let's do it together. Complete the sentences in column A with the appropriate information there from column B. About 60 years ago, about 60 years ago, what? The example says. Many TV shows. Many TV shows were in black and white. Yeah, many TV shows were in black and white. Okay. Before the automobile. The letter D. People oh, didn't travel as much from city to city. Yes, good. People didn't travel as much from city to city. Number three. Who wants to read number three? Letter A. Letter Who A. Letter A. Before there were supermarkets, people used to shop in small, small grocery stores. Oh, good. Vamos a ver. Number four. In most offices these days. Letter F. People work more than 40, 40 hours, hours a week. A week. Good. <laughs> number five. In many cities nowadays. <clears throat> There will probably no. It's letter B. B. Pollution is becoming a pollution. serious problem. Number six. In many classrooms today, students are learning interactive whiteboards. Interactive whiteboard. Good. Uh, seven. In the next one hundred years. Doctor might find a cure for the common cold. Yeah. Mm. Uh, there will be there probably, will probably there, be there will probably the be space. cities in the space. A oh. hey, number eight. Okay. Sometimes yes. in the yes. near future, yeah. doctors might find a cure doctors for the common goal. Cold, no gold. <laughs> cold. All right. Yeah. So um, thank you so much for uh, staying here. Uh, even though I can see some of you sleeping, for example, Javier, he wants to go to sleep now. <laughs> so thank you so much, everyone, uh, for joining us today. I hope to see you tomorrow, okay? Thank okay. you, thank you so thank much. You Have a wonderful night. Okay. I will see you tomorrow, okay? Yes. Thank you, teacher. Thank you, teacher. Okay. Bye. Good night. Bye, 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 everyone. Bye, bye. bye good night. Good night. Bye, bye.